Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jay from JS Films. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at Unreal Engine 5.6's MetaHuman Creator. Now, as you all know, I've been messing around with 5.6 for a couple of months. This right here, they snuck it in. I had no idea it was in here because it's a plugin. And whenever I look at MetaHuman Creator plugin, I assumed it was the old one. But this is a definitely new one. I am currently downloading a new version because they're just adding some stuff on there three hours ago. But this version I've had for like... I would say like a month at least. So it might not have all the stuff, but I'm going to go ahead and talk about this uh, right now. Big thanks to Massel P for letting me know that this exists right now. Let's take a look at this new version. This is massive uh, because as you can see right here, right off the bat, they have now some body fit and some blend fit. Now this body fit right here, bruh, people have been asking for this for a long time. I mean, now we have all kinds of different customization for the height. You know, I can make this shorter so I can actually put in my height and stuff like that so we don't have like the same exact, you know, meet a tall, uh, short, average, whatever we have now. This is pretty darn cool. I'll just reset everything because I just was kind of messing around. Um, we're just going to go through this and see. Oh, I can even give muscles now? Bro, What? Like, as you all know, I have, like, a meta-human right now, like, of myself. And one of the things that it's lacking is, like, my mass, like, my muscles. So with this here, I can actually accurately put in, you know, the circumference of my bicep, which is freaking huge, and my elbow, because I have a huge elbow. So this is good. Shoulder fat, I have zero. So, dude, this is freaking insane. I'm not sure. I have a lot of meta-human clothes. I'm not sure how this is going to work with that. But look at this. This is cool. Now, the the head part, I'm just messing around in here. Okay, so when you blend it, what the crap? Okay, so this right here, I feel like we're going to have a lot more. I started to see some stuff that they're adding in these, try to fill in the blanks. Now, this is experimental, people. Like, we shouldn't even be seeing this right now. But this is crazy. We have some sculpt. I'm just messing around. And you can randomize the face now, which is cool. So if I, like, cancel this and, like, randomize it, it's going to give me a different person. That's really cool because right now... Oh, shoot. We got more sculpting? I feel like we have more points. That I feel like that's more points than we had before, but I don't know. It's been a while since I've been here. They have, uh... Ooh, they have some ROM stuff in here. Okay, so you can import your own animation. I'm just, guys, I'm I'm just messing around with it in here. I I like. I have no idea how everything is working. If I'm even doing anything right, but yeah, there's there's a lot of stuff in here. I don't know if everything is kind of plugged in, but we're gonna keep moving because this is exciting. Conform. Oh, okay. So this is the DNA. I'm not gonna touch that because I don't have any DNA. All right. So we got model eyelashes, teeth. Let's talk about the teeth. Let's give it some GTA 6 teeth. You know, GTA 6 teeth is like this. Um, spacing. It's like that. No, I'm just joking. Yo, we have worn down now? Yo, what the... F Let's go, bro. Let's fucking go. Oh my god, yes. Tim Sweeney cooked again. Alright, looks like we got a couple of eyelashes in here. Now, this is not the cloud version. This is just a built-in version inside the engine itself. All right, so I'm actually in the engine, as you can see right here. Kind of prove this to you. I have these two suspicious characters hanging out in here, all sweaty and shit. So here we go. Okay, it's like a body type. Oh my god, there's so much stuff. Materials, makeup. Do I have makeup in here? Okay, so they're starting to move the stuff from the cloud to here so you don't actually have to go to the cloud but i've already seen these stuff like clay editable this is cool dude oh man we got so much to do here this is pretty cool got makeup eyes which is the same as before um i don't recognize anything new as far as the makeup goes but let's take a look at the wardrobe there's an edit wardrobe tool so, what? 
So there's going to be some... There's a villager in here right now. So my guess is... We're going to get some presets in here? Kind of like a meta-human? Like an actual creator? Prepare selected assets for the costume. Okay, so right now, there's really nothing loaded in here. So I'll just accept it, because there's nothing. Maybe they'll fill that in, because this is what I was kind of like. What the fuck is this? Auto rig. Okay, this is crazy, dude. This is, this is just overwhelming right now. What what is what what do you mean odor rig? Like can I import stuff? Uh, AK texture still, okay. Create mesh. Import the data in your file and creates the facious skeletal mesh. Alright. Costume. Alright, so there's no costumes yet. There's none of that stuff, but I am seeing some stuff that they're adding slowly. So I'm gonna keep you all updated when it comes to this, but right now it looks like we have new body types. That's the biggest one. And it looks like they have some presets. But I don't know if this is going to be user presets that we make. Or it's going to be, you know, presets that they're going to give us. But, yeah, I'm going to be messing around with this a lot. So this is like your typical blend. Okay, so I know what this is. So this is your usual in the cloud, meta human creator. You can put three faces in there and you can blend it. So that's what that is. Okay, that makes sense for the head. But this randomized tool, I really like. Because look at this. I can just kind of like flip through this and get a whole new face. Very cool. So now we have literally unlimited face. Oh, look at that. I even got that uh, Forrest Whitaker thing going on. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I'll keep you all updated. Let me know in the comments below what you all think. But this is good news.